Hey guys, this is John from John Old Games, and we are back for part six of the Bug Snacks walk gameplay walkthrough on PlayStation 5. So I left off pretty much in uh is it sugar? What's it called? Sugar yeah, sugar pine woods. And I gotta catch this Charmalo. Um there was one that was on top of here that I already caught on the previous video. And I was having a bit of a trouble time trying to figure out how to grab the other one, but it seems like I kind of kind of have to trip it up and then let it drop into either some like hot water or snow or something like that to capture it. Now, I'm not even sure if this last one is here right now. They only come out at certain times during the day, if I remember correctly. Yeah, where are they in my uh, Bugopedia here? And we're what on sugar? Yeah, where is he? Okay, so he's 4 p.m. to 4 a.m. Okay, then I'm just gonna have to find a bed really quick and uh, fast forward really quick because it's what 1:40 their time. Yeah. Just go to 5 p.m. Yeah, here we go. A little bit darker out there. Should he be just chilling up there? Man, are you serious? I had like this whole last video that we were doing. There's one circle in here and I easily put 10 minutes of work into him and I still never got him. Here, we'll just fly around here. This is like one of my only main quests is to catch one more of these guys. Oh, please tell me. Oh, he's over here. This is going to be way easier than the other side. That's what I wanted to see. All right. So I, I kind of looked this one up. I hate to say it just because it was a pain in the ass or what it was being a pain in the ass. And all right. Okay, this might be kind of lame. Is it, is it actually going to grab it? Oh, there we go. See, gets the fire off of him and we caught one already. Look how easy that was. I just wanted it spawn over here. There's one that was way up at the tower and it was just a pain in the butt to try to do anything with it. All right, so now we got to feed these two. This little nerdy guy in here, we're trying to get out of here and move back to town. Yeah, Snorby. All right, let's feed him two of those Charmellos. Does it matter? Let's just, I like to do their arms usually. We already did his teeth with our Oreo cookies or whatever. <laughs> with that blind spot in place, I can safely return to Snacksburg. Meet me outside. Hmm. And do. This guy seems clear of danger. I suppose it's now or never. Whoa. Snorpy's ready to go? All right, dog, let's do this. In just a moment, Chandler. You've been an invaluable ally. I'm even tempted to call you a friend, but quietly so I'm not overheard. <laughs> if I didn't think it'd crush you like a tin can, I would hug the grump out of you. Oh, what the grump? Here it comes! Uh oh. What expert hugging that is. You do that hug. All right, let's get out of here. Race you back to town, Snorp Dog. No, please don't make me run with you, Chandlo. Snorp Dog. If you're not up for it, I could always carry you. No, no, that's quite all right. Your loss. See you back in Wait. town, bro. Chandlo. Oh, look at two more people back in town. So we can finally, we pretty much worked on them for most of last video over here. So hopefully we'll get to do a new area. I caught a bunch of these guys over here. Oh, there's one right there too. Um... Find out what Cromdo does at midnight. That's a side quest for, I think, Befica. Might get that done because I can just fast forward time till midnight. Also, with the other two moving back to town, I can interview them. I might as well get their interviews done and then I'm going to do the Befica side quest. And it looks like Philbo's got I something for me, too. Ooh, gonna quiz me, dog? I'll crush your questions. Mm-hmm. Start. Yeah, might as well get the two interviews over. We got to do 12. This should be 7, 8, or 8, 9, I think. Chandlo Funkbun, 
I left. I left. It's a way of life, bro. Anything that needs to go up. Logs, buildings, balls, Snorpy. I'll get him there. Why come to Snack Tooth Island? If I want to push my limits, I gotta go somewhere extreme. I heard nobody comes back from this island. Sounds like a challenge to me. Uh, that's fine for you, but what about Snorpy? Hey, I'm always looking out for Snorpy. I know roughing it isn't his style, but there's no way I was coming here without him. How did you two become a thing? I don't know what you mean, dog. We're like the sky and the sea. We've been together since the dawn of time. Best friends, that's what I like to hear. Thoughts on bug snacks? Strong. Like a primal kind of strong. Like they own this place, and I gotta respect that. Why did you leave town? Bro, Snacksburg was a disaster without Lizbert. I couldn't stop all the fighting with lifting or wisdom. I gotta keep things chill for Snorpy. He's got a lot of that social anxiety. Lizbert is top dog, you feel me? She really inspires me to test my limits. But, uh, that's about it. I'm really tighter with Egabel. Egabel's a sweetie. She was always looking out for me. Showed me how to stay safe while still pushing my limits. But she was always pushing herself way harder. Uh, she was working out? Yeah, she asked me to train her. Surprised the grump out of me, because she really wasn't built for that kind of stuff. We'd go running every morning and lifting after lunch. Though she would get real down on herself sometimes. But she never gave up, and I respect that. What happened to Lizbird and Agabel? I wish I could tell you. Those two were strong together. I can't think of anything that could take them down. They gotta be okay out there. Somewhere. Thank you, sir. Bro, that's not... Just... Don't. Anyway, I recorded Agabel's progress while we were working out. She shared some pretty private stuff. But maybe it'll help you bring her back to us. Don't let me down, bro. Oh, thanks. I uh, gave you Agabel's chest key. Check journal for more details. Cool. Thanks, dude. Where is that? Big story. Okay, cool. We got that. Got the Boiling Bay map. I'm assuming I think that might be the next area. All right, let's get his interview done as well. Are you mad? I can't have my secrets plastered all over the front page news. Of course I do, but at the same time, I don't want them finding me. Hmm. I suppose I can reveal a tad bit, so long as my identity is protected. <clears throat> I am Snorp Redacted. Mean. Haha, <laughs> redacted. ...to inventing devices that foil the machinations of the Grumpinati. I was dragged here by my dearest friend, Chan Redacted. He thought I needed some fresh air or something. Much as I hate the outdoors, I simply can't say no to him. Well, I, 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 I mean, we've been together since kindergarten. It would make perfect sense if we were together together. He's never said we are, has he? I surmise they are some sort of synthetic life form designed to beguile our taste buds. I'm so glad you asked. I believe there may be a factory located on this very island, hidden somewhere deep underground. I have charts. Let me show you my charts later. I was too exposed. Flufty tried to wrap me up in their experiments, now that Lizbert and Agabel weren't around to occupy them. I could see that this was the next step in the Grumpinati's plot against me. Lizbert disappears, we are hit with an earthquake, we suffer a snack shortage, all that in one day. Do you really think those are all coincidences? The timeline is on my charts. Elizabeth Megafig was a curious sort, and had a foolish bone in her body. 
She could rival me in wit and chat. Redacted. Blow an arm wrestling. We would share secrets now and again. Dreadful, terrible secrets. <laughs> I'm not telling you the terrible secrets because they are terrible and secret. Excellent interrogation, chum. So great that you deserve another hugging experience. Uh-oh. I love all the redacted. <laughs> hey, this must not go on the record. Elizabeth Megafig discovered something on the island that came to me for help. An entrance to the underground, locked behind a strange device. I assisted her in unraveling its secrets, and soon after, she vanished. You must take extreme caution. I can tell you where to find it, but the rest is up to you. Oh, thank you. A new map. All right, I'm going to... We got their two interviews done. I captured that last bug that I needed to capture to get him off the sugar pine forest area or mountain area. I am going to... Here, I'm just going to skip to midnight so I can get that side quest done. All right, so who are we going after? I think it's the sales guy that Befica doesn't really like. Now I got to find him is the question around here. Oh, there he is. We just kind of have to slowly follow him and see what he's doing at nighttime. I'm surprised most of these guys are up at midnight. This guy's sleepwalking. Definitely. You're definitely like doing some spying quests, capturing different bugs, helping people get back to town. It's a lot of fun. I gotta admit, I'm having a really blast here. Oh, he's just chilling. He likes to vibe out at midnight. Mm hmm. Just a chilling. Do I have to watch his whole dance? Oh God. <laughs> do the wiggle. Do the wiggle. I do the wiggle. Do the wiggle. Do the wiggle with me. Yeah. There? Is somebody there? You didn't hear anything, pal. You got that? Not a single peep. Oh, that was funny. Wow. Okay, let's just go sleep till morning now. I'm not going to wake you up. I wouldn't do that. I'm not that type of guy. 5 a.m. Usually everyone's up by then. Yeah, where's Befica? Oh, everyone's got quests and stuff. OMG. That explains why he's always so jealous of Wiggle. Why would he even hide that? It almost makes him kind of likable. Who else ran by here? I know Philbo needs me. Uh, where was that other character? He kind of just dashed on me. Oh, right there. Man, he's just gumming it. What's up, dog? Yeah, dog. I'm trying to pull up this stump so I can build a bebop core. I'm about as swole as a grumpus can get, and I can't move this thing at all. I gotta be stronger than a grumpus. I gotta push my limits, you feel me? Uh, I need your help to bulk up. If you go find the biggest, buffest bug snacks around, and I eat them, maybe I'll gain their strength. <laughs> Catch aggressive meaty bug snacks. I already got one of them. Here, I'll talk to Philbo. You're doing a great job, buddy. But hey, don't forget to take care of yourself. In fact, maybe you should turn in early today and just relax. 
Good idea. Maybe that gets my new area. Uh oh. Huh. Something's wrong, buddy. We better take a look. Pefika, Ramble, what happened? We saw something real spooky walk right into town. I thought it was a grumpus at first, but like something about it was wrong. Was this creature wearing a crown by any chance? Or was it perhaps holding some sort of ceremonial dagger? What? No, no nothing like that. It looked kind of normal until it... Oh, until it... It turned into a bunch of bug snacks and like scattered. Frankly, I find that hard to swallow. Ah, what a load, Biff. Not enough drama around town for you lately, huh? Zonk off, Cromdo. Unlike you, I don't lie for a living. Oh, wow. So tell me then, what were you doing skulking around at midnight? Breaking into huts? Again? I seen it too. And this time I know it's not just one of my nightmares. Get some grump and sleep, Gramble. I can't. Not with all of y'all around here with your hungry mouths. Don't take this the wrong way, darling, but you are a bit high strung. A little beauty sleep would do you wonders. Maybe then you'd finally let us eat a few pets. You say that again. Oh, get off me. Stop. Whoa, hey, chill the grump out, bros. There's no need for all that. If what Gramble and Befica are saying is true, there's got to be some physical evidence left behind. Yeah? Indeed. We should sweep the perimeter and keep watch in case the creature returns. Um, uh, good idea. Uh, buddy, do you think you can scope out the restroom? You know, find out what they saw? The restroom? Okay, I guess we're checking the restroom. Ooh, we see these glowing and footprints and shit. Bug prints. What was that, like, question mark? I could have just scanned... Oh, the warning sign. Scan the area for clues. Okay. What else is there? Spade, what's this right here? A broken lock. Okay, where's Philbo? There you go, bud. We did a little detective work. You found what you were looking for? All right, I'll call everybody together. Well, w w what did you find? There are tracks that aren't quite grumpus. Something left a deadly message behind. It's probably aliens. Well... That's, um, I reckon there's got to be some other explanation. Cram it, Wampo. We got a genuine monster on our paws. Hmm, monster's a bit of a prejudicial term, don't you think? I'd call it more of a cryptid or undiscovered animal. It's no animal, darling. We're witnessing the queen of bug snacks in action. She's given us a warning! Oh, that is absurd. Which is more likely, that a so far unseen giant bug snack politely left a note on our door? Or that this is some form of coordinated gaslighting by the Grump and our- What's more likely, dear, is that you've watched far too many movies. Well, at least my theory has scientific data behind it, whereas you haven't even drawn one chart. <gasps> I was top of the charts, thank you. Whoa, 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 you know what? Let's split the difference, eh? You're both wrong. Uh, what does it even matter? Whatever it is, it wants us dead. Between this and the earthquakes, Snacksburg's becoming pretty unlivable. I hate to say it, bro, but I regret coming down from the mountain. Me and Snorpy were a lot safer before we came back. Same goes for me and my little ones. No, no, no. We shouldn't split up again. We're better off if we're all here together. That might have been true when Lisbert was around, but those days are long gone. You don't know that. She might come back. <laughs> don't hold your breath, pal. 
Face it, Philbo. Without Lizbert, all we have is you. That's... that's... not true. Listen, I don't know why Lizbert put me in charge, but I do know this. None of you were really happy out there alone. We don't have Lizbert, but we have each other. Maybe if we try, we could all add up to one of her. <sighs> I guess you're not wrong. So, we're all staying in town then? Seems like it. As long as we can watch each other's backs. If we're gonna make it, we need everybody here. Floofty and Sheldar are still out there, and, and who knows if they're safe. If you must find Floofty, according to the tracking device I placed on them, they're out by Boiling Bay. And the last time I saw Shelda, she was meditating in the sizzling sands. But don't forget about Egabel. If she's not with Lisbert, we gotta find her. We will, Chandlow. And once we do, we'll throw a big welcome back party. How does that sound? Okay. Great! Now, let's go get some sleep. He placed a tracking device on her. Oh man, that's great. That's hilarious. Yeah, I'm gonna get any last quest from people and I can kind of get them while I'm out. How's it going? Maybe. Maybe Sprout can help. I'm sure he can show Charwe the ropes. What do you say? Alrighty. Ooh. I remember this not going too well last time. Use the Bugsy Ball to guide Charwe to the... I don't know, like I didn't, could not get him going and I don't think I'm allowed to jump down. God damn, that's why I didn't start it before is because this one's glitched, I think. Oh no, here we oh, okay, I gotcha. Chocolate. Ah, I just was not paying attention, okay. I don't know why I got this guy if all I'm doing is throwing chocolate down. Oh no, 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 no. Where's my guy here? What happened? I don't know why he's not coming out of there. Is there something I have to do? Here, we gotta collect some more of these, it looks like. Where did he go, actually? Oh, maybe we'll throw this down. And he's being annoying. <laughs> okay, let's get a bit more. It looks like it just loads five or six and at a time.
Oh, that's what it is, is to get the people, the characters out of the way. Okay, I get it now. Sorry, guys, this was a side quest I tried to do before, but I was really confused on what to do. All right, so you got to do multiple things. There is a bunch of that stuff down, but the this guy is just to get everyone else out of the way. Oh, man, they keep breaking it. Come on, there you go. And it's still not getting away from him. Wow. That's a pain in the butt. Alright, come on. And they just like drop kick it as soon as they see it. Guess it never can be that easy, eh? Oh no. Huh. And he's just not moving at all. What I really need is Befica to get her butt going. The guy Charwee to the finish. And Philbo's all good. This is getting shitty. Um, how did I get the last guy off? I just, or last person off of her. Oh no, come on. You you got to like it better. There we go, bud. Oh no, 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 no. Oh no, it went back. <laughs> this is just a disaster. This is like the hardest side quest I've had to do in the game. We got it all the way over there, and now he cannot not get an off her side again. Africa, you gotta get your butt out of there. Like, I wanna get this quest done. Oh, I shouldn't have pressed it. That's my regret. The only thing I'm not a big fan of, guys, is I don't think I'm allowed to quit this. Like, if I don't wanna do this, I gotta finish this. Otherwise, I'm like stuck in it unless I wanna quit out to the main menu or something, you know? Like, you know, I, I kinda would like to just say no, I'm good. Training day. Yeah, I don't think that's happening right now, bud. Wombus, you gotta get out of the way, dude. Right here, bud.
Yay. Oh, a good boy. Charlie's a good boy. Yes, he is. Man, that was a little well, painful for started. a bit there. But I'm a long ways off from teaching them to spell out, we love you, Papa. Why, I have to cover myself in sauce every morning just to get them to pay attention to me. But that's just the way it goes. You pour every little bit of love you got into somebody and you just hope they notice. Okay, well, that was more longer than I hoped I was going to do that quest for, but... Uh... The map. Am I allowed going to somewhere new now? Okay, the Scorch Gorge. Search the Frosted Peak. Who did I get that quest from? I've yet braved the mountain peak, but it seems I'll find clues about Lisbon and Agabur or Flutie and Boiling Bay. So I wonder if I got, I think Boiling Bay might be connected down to the Shimmering Springs. I'm hoping we're going to open up that area of this video here, guys. We got a lot of story stuff done on this last half an hour or so here. Oh, those guys almost never come out of the ground. Yeah, usually they're always underground. That's weird. Oh, who's this? Are they going to open that up for me? Ooh, there we go. Boiling Bay's open, finally. Nice. Ooh, that was a weird way to enter a level. All right, hopefully, we're pretty much going to work on Boiling Bay for the rest of this one, guys. I'm excited for a new area. And more pe Pokedex, uh, or, or Bugadex filling. I love taking the pictures. It definitely reminds me of Pokemon Snap. Golden Weeble. I'm just trying to snap anything I can see from here. Otherwise, keep loading up on whatever we can for right now, I guess. Ooh, actually, I can go over here right now. Just go take a peek. Oh, uh, that's a crab. Oh, that's like a hot dog or a banana jumping back and forth. I think it was a hot dog. Could be wrong, though. Oh, that's another, like, soda-like creature. I remember that soda that we had in like the early, early areas. I caught a couple. Search Frost Peak. I'm going to do the Boiling Bay one. Yeah, let's do that. Uh, it looks like in here there's stuff too. Okay. Oh, I remember that guy from the previous area. We got a lava area too. Flaming cheese puff. Oh, and we got a new cut. Oh no, this is the hot sauce. Okay. Noodler. Oh, that's probably like ramen. Nope. This is kind of a cool area. You got beach and you got kind of a lava area. Anything else I can take pictures of? I got pics of everything in here. Oh, you can't do that, eh? Oh, and he just puts me on fire like everybody else, it seems, in this in the fire areas. Grape Skeeto. Oh, what's that? Is he down for the count? Oh, no. Oh. Okay, okay. Nope, that didn't work out. Find Floofy in Boiling Bay. Now, she was the one that definitely ran into this area, which is kind of weird. 
wonder how you capture those guys. They would, they would be pretty hard to capture, I'm assuming. Okay, there's a chest. This is actually a bigger area than I was kind of thinking it was. And I like that the music changes per area too, I'm noticing. We're mainly just trying to find her. I'm not really. Oh, here she is. Precious time getting here. Any longer, and my leg might have rotted away. Come on, uh -huh. let's finish our work. Absolutely not. I'm on the verge of a breakthrough. Now assist me, or be gone with you. Ah, always a question worth asking. Preparations for my grand experiment are nearly complete. Soon we will see if we can amend my ambulation. But for now. Simply transform my arm into a red banapa. <laughs> red banapa, eh? Oh, and I've taken a picture of one of these guys already. I swear I have. Actually, yeah. Oh, are they the ones that... Oh, they're doing the old hiding between trees, I'm thinking. Yeah. Yeah, I gotta get by myself so I'm not getting attacked all the time doing this. Okay, I think our best shot... I'm gonna see if I can do the trip shot here. See if that works. Maybe I can knock it. Will it work? Nope, he's jumping. Will he jump back? Oh, that's that's a bad spot. Okay. Got him. There we go. I knew that was the way to do it. And turn her hand into a banoffer. Okay. One more thing I must do. Hand me the Snacktivator. The old Snacktivator was worthless scrap. I have updated it. Oh, cool. It is now capable of altering snack matter through a process of sonic anamnesis. Ugh. My body remembers what I eat. The Snacktivator can change snackified limbs into anything I've ever eaten. Use it. Change my arm from Bonapra to Strabby. Bonapra to Strabby? Ooh. Snack experiment. Are you amazed? You've seen nothing yet. If my hypothesis is correct, the bug snacks can remember the shape of my body. It is time to test that hypothesis. Use the snack activator on my missing leg. <laughs> Aha! Uh -huh. My leg is back. Bug snacks can cure the sick, revitalize the frail. This discovery will reshape the world. To think Elizabeth and Agabel walked away from that. <laughs> Pathetic. <clears throat> but I refuse to dwell on personal matters while there is yet more work to do. Use the snack activator again. Transform my limbs into cocomites. Coconut? Oh, cocomites. Okay. I don't think I've actually found those guys yet. Oh, a green one. There we are. How do we get that guy up there? I am assuming I might have to launch pad this one. And we'll throw that up. Maybe I have to go up there and grab it. Oh.
Man, they just don't, will not leave me alone, eh? That is what I'm noticing. Where's this pineapple or uh, coconut I got? Cannot, cannot grab them. Is that what it is? I don't have that one yet. Oh, and where's this guy going? Do they just follow me around? It's his buddy? Oh. I think this guy is what, frozen? Is he not coming back? He's almost like glitched. Um, which one should I get rid of? I wish I had more uh, spots for these guys. I don't know about the quick quickie. Uh, we got one though. Why not? Let's see if this works on her. Limbs into. Yum, yum, yum. Unbelievable. Okay, so that's one of them. Now the question is to find more. Where can we find more of those coconut guys? One's like glitched in the earth or wherever that was. I have no idea. Kirby. He's kind of cool. We got a feeling he's going to be a one we got to capture. I gotta pay attention to more of these because I know I've missed one or two or three of those to be honest. This guy coming back? Oh, he's probably like a journey. Yeah, probably on here because he has to go on top. What? Oh no, now he knows I'm here. I had to capture one because why not? All right, let's find our coconut guy. This guy, I think he's stuck. And I can't even get him back. That's the question. The weird part. Okay, he, he's he's a lost cause. I hate to say it. Okay, so we got one. How many of these are out here? There's only like another tree or two, I think. We may have to... Oh, there's a... Okay, gotta throw another one down here. That's too bad, because there's only two, and I was hoping to get both halves, but does not look like that's gonna happen actually I need to go back to that guy that was running at me whoa even the little guy can do that all right, I might have just screwed myself over there. I hate to say it. Oh, no, here we go. Like drop kicking this.
Oh no no no! I want to get grab it, not not be able to grab it. Oh uh, no! Where'd he go? Where'd he go? Where'd he go? Can I get uh, get this fire off and get him? Nope. Doesn't look like it. God damn it. Every time I want to get it and somebody hits him, I'm on fire every time. Yes, throw him somewhere that I need to get him. Oh, of course. That's how you're going to be, are you? God damn it, Noodler. Yeah, I'm going to be waiting for the Noodler to grab him, no? Wow, four of those is a tall order. Holy crap, lady. I don't know about that one. I think she's dreaming on these. There we go. Come on, Coco. Oh, right where it wasn't on fire. That was a very smart throw, Noodler. Oh, it actually let me catch him. Wow. All right, inchworm, that's an easier one to capture. Okay, we got a second one. This is a chore right now, I hate to say it. Doing the four of these? Oh god, there's four of them now. Her limbs. All right. Oh man, that's even out here still, eh? Yeah, we got two. These guys are forever frozen. It's looking like. It's over here again. Oh, just eye fake eyeballs. That's hilarious. Well, the coconuts are done, and I think two of them are, like, gone, gone, so I'm going to reload the area quick. I really would like to get those uh, other two limbs for her before we get out of this video here. Shimmering springs, and we'll just jump right back to where we were to try to get this done. Pretty decent size areas, and there's what, like 8 or 10 different areas throughout the game? Then you got the main hub town where you're always visiting with uh, the main characters, doing side quests, interviewing. Yeah, it's very cool. Okay, Queeble, where is my coconut friends? And they better not be like glitch frozen in here, because I need two halves. Okay. This could be it as long as they don't all like die and fly somewhere. Jesus, okay. <laughs> oh, actually, let's go in, yeah, the fire. 
The ice just freezes them. It doesn't really do me any good, so... Why did I put that down there? Still won't let me do it because he's in the water, uh, the fire there. All right, we're not having a good time on this. Come on. I actually need the noodlers to throw them, otherwise, it's just we're in this stuck circle I'm not even sure what they like. Um, what's another smart one that we could end up doing? Maybe a trip shot? Okay, that's a lot easier. Oh no? Are they still on fire is the question. Oh wow, that is so much easier if I would have known that. Hey, okay, we're almost done. We gotta wait till he gets uh, some of that fire off him. Oh, Noodler, why are you throwing my thing? Oh, and they threw him again? Poor guy, that coconut, I tell ya. Alright, we're gonna give her one back, and then the uh, last one is hopefully what I'm gonna get, and we'll get her uh, her four coconut limbs. It's weird to say, but... Your precious time. Come. Yum, yum, yum. Oh, One more. At this point, I want him out of the cave now, because now I know what to do. No. No. Where did he go? Where did he go? Where did he go? Oh, no. Thank you. Oh, that was painful. Painful. All right, we got him. We got him. Unbelievable. Hmm. My body has changed into more cocomites than I've eaten. Can you even comprehend what has happened? This means that all bug snacks are one and the same. Each one could change into any other with the right stimulus. And now, that is true of me. Now, use the snack activator to its full potential. I want limbs of Noodler, Cocomite, Bonopper, and Strabby all at once. 
Holy. Really? Uh, and a red turn. Do I have a red? No, I don't. Do I? And then a noodler? Is that what she wanted? Where is a noodler right now? Sugar, pine, coconut. Okay, here we go. We got greater, lesser. Oh, noodler. Oh, okay, here we go. In the lava caves. I'm like, what? What is she talking about? There you go. Oh, and you're the one I have to lure over to maybe our buddy over here. Come on. Oh no, Noodler's like, no, not today, buddy, not today. So how do I need to get one of these ice guys to slam them? Okay, let's throw this down just because. Oh man, now I'm on fire and I can't get it. Come on. Work with me here. Nope. <sighs> All right, I don't know if I will be able to finish this for this video. Noodler's not being really nice. Oh, and don't hit him back into the water, dude. Oh, and he's already on fire. Jesus. Alright, guys. I think that's probably going to be it for this video. I will come back next video. And hopefully we can get that noodler and finish off this quest for... Floofty uh, here. I hope you guys enjoyed part six uh, walkthrough of Bug Snacks. And uh, if you guys enjoyed my videos, just thumbs up and a subscribe would really help me out. I'd appreciate it. And I will see you guys in the next video. Peace.